What's the deal? What's the deal? It's your boy Louis Hendo, and we back talking sports. So my Warriors, they uh they won again last night. Um, as you know, I don't really watch the NBA as much as I used to, but this is around the time I do start back watching um, games after the All Star break. I really start watching my Warriors and stuff like that. So even though I said I did say I'm not watching them until they get over 500, I will make an exception if they win tonight because they have a back to back. If they win tonight, I'll make an exception, and I'm just say because it's after the All Star break and for real. And I want them to win these next couple of games because then we can get over 500. We got Atlanta, um, Brooklyn. And a couple more, uh, a couple more, because right now we're in sh- we're in terrible territory right now. <laughs> we're twelve, so we behind the Rockets, Jazz, the Fakers. You know, we got Atlanta, Brooklyn, Philly, Indiana. I think we could win all those games, but we have to do that. But I want to talk about Jonathan Kaminga who have been balling really for the last 15, 15, 16 games. Averaging 23 points, 6 rebounds, and 2.4 assists in the last 10 games. He's been our second best player this year, Steph and him. And then you can say Draymond and then whoever else you're going to put. But Kaminga has been our second best player this year, bro. He is fulfilling. This is what Andrew Wiggins is supposed to be doing. But Kaminga said, don't worry, I got it. Kaminga said, don't worry, I got it. Man, I just had to give Jonathan Kaminga some love because, no, we're not trading him. Definitely not trading him for no LeBron. I've been seeing those. I've been seeing that shit out here. We're not trading Jonathan Kaminga for no damn for no damn LeBron. No, not at all. We're not going to bring that foolishness over here. But Jonathan Kaminga been balling. He's underrated. I think next year he could be an all-star. I think so. I think he, because this year, I believe, was his breakout year. He could get most, most improved. He could be in the running for most improved. But I think that's going to be Tyrese Halliburton. But Tyrese Halliburton is getting close to missing all, you know what I'm saying, postseason awards. So it could be Jonathan Kaminga. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but yeah, the last 10 games, he's been amazing. 23.6 rebounds, two assists. Warriors, uh, beat the Grizzlies, 121-101, as they should have the first time. I don't know what the hell was going on, but Draymond obviously has helped since he came back. You know what I'm saying? His, his, uh, stuff don't come up on the stat sheet. Um. Dante Kaminga keep playing like this. We definitely still do need to trade. We need to go get Lori Market. That's what we need to do. That's what I feel we need to do because the West is so tough this year and so close this year. We're not out of it. Five game winning streak, bro. We back. We back in it. Boom. You know what I'm saying? We back in the play in. But we have to consistently put together a couple more wins, bro, and get back on track. Hopefully, we do do a trade. And everything, but I mean, if not, we just gonna have to roll with the dogs we got and get in and get into the play-in. If we get into the play-in, who knows what could happen? You know what I'm saying? We really need to get into that seventh, eighth seed, so we can only play one game, and then you know what I'm saying we win that game, we get to the uh, playoffs. So, shout out to Jonathan Kaminga, man. Shout out to my Warriors for the good win last night, man. Like, share, subscribe. Album coming soon. You know what I'm saying? I hope y'all support my music. Um. I appreciate y'all, man. I'm out. Peace.